So hello everyone, in this video, I will be explaining a project named Hunting Serial Killers. Problem Statement In 1996, criminologist Kim Rosmo has developed a formula that predicts where a serial criminal lives. We try to implement this mathematical model on our own. So, what is the new thing that we have done? Because it is already implemented. The new thing that we try to implement is that we merge the image of crime location and hotspot of criminals location with the map. If I will say in one sentence our project predicts the maximum probability of criminals residence from his crime locations. We have used concepts like geographic profiling and Rosmos formula. So first I will give a brief idea of these all concepts and at the end we will see some real life cases which were solved by geographic profiling and Rosmos formula. A lot of criminological research has been done to analyze the behavior of serial killers and it is found that two axioms are most common. One, a serial killer will not commit crimes too close to his base of operation. The second one is a serial killer will not travel farther than necessary to find victims. There are tons of examples of these axioms in action in criminology literature. On the other hand, many examples don't agree with these axioms. Some killers pick their victims with such specific characteristics or some killers murder while traveling the country. By keeping these two axioms in mind, we built a mathematical model. What is geographic profiling? The geographic profiling model is based on the assumption that offenders are more likely to select their victims and commit a crime that would be centered near their home address. Criminal acts follow a distance decay function such that after a specific distance of his residence, there is less chance that he will engage in criminal activity. However, there is also a buffer zone where an offender will not commit crimes too close to their homes as mentioned in the first axiom. According to criminologist Dr. Kim Rosmo, there are four types of offenders concerning geographic profiling. Hunter, poacher, troller and trapper. You can read these all things from the Wikipedia in detail. Rosmo's formula. So this is the formula from which the maximum probability of criminal's residence can be calculated. In this formula, the concept of Manhattan distance is used. How does the formula work? We may say that the residence of the criminal is likely outside a buffer of some radius surrounding each crime. For a fixed location, we will compute the probability of each cell is the offender's house and simply sum them up for different locations. Here probabilities will not be between 0 to 1 because we sum them up so they will be compared relatively. Now we will see some cases which were solved by using this formula. You can read about these serial killers from Wikipedia. The first serial killer was caught by using this formula is Richard Jazz. He was known as Vampire of Sacramento. Here you can see the use of matrix and these are the crime locations and this is buffer radius. F and G are formal empirically tuned parameters. Variation in F and G changes the steepness of the decay curve before and after the buffer radius. By entering these all details in the model, the hotspot of criminal's residence is found. Albert D. Selvo. He was known as Boston Strangler. So, these are the details. And this is the location of his residence that we found. Peter Sutcliffe. He was known as the Yorkshire Reaper. This is a different case. In this case, we got two locations of his residence. So, this case can be considered as the limitation of this model.
we implemented this model in MATLAB and MATLAB provides the functionality like sliders. By using sliders, we can add the details very easily. So we don't need to change the values in the program. Here, as you can see, we merge the image that we got from the model with the map. You can also visit our website to learn these all things in detail. The source code and the PDF in which the whole project is explained in the detail you will find on the website and the link is given in the description.